Ginky. <laughs> Calls cougars down from the mountain. And they're leaving now. Okay, uh, if I want a cougar in my camp, then I blow it in the mountains and the cougars will come. The didgeridoo itself uh, has what is called a cat's fur resonance. Originally, I made it as a didgeridoo amplifier. The only person in the world has figured out how to make a didge from buffalo hide. We have between 2,000 and 2,500 plus shoppers per day. Do you want to share one? I'll just make a bigger, uh, right now we're, share it with the group. I think today we've got 58 shop or 58 vendors. We welcome any vendors that make it, make it, grow it. Um, prioritizing farmers, of course, and produce uh, locally grown. We've got all sorts of locals. We've got people coming in from Pemberton and uh, North Vancouver, Vancouver. It's just a great spot for the family and for all ages and abilities to come and connect with the community. It's, uh, it's not just a market where you grab and go, it's a uh, grab, sit, chat, listen, learn, and connect. Bye. It's been supported by Van City, who uh, has given the market a grant. And then with that grant money, they give me money, and I go buy this stuff from the uh, local vendors here at the farmer's market. So aside from a little bit of the oil, the salt and pepper, everything today has been purchased here.